Hi, my name is Roosh. I'm a nurse practitioner at Stanford's Otolaryngology Department. Today, I'm going to talk to you about how to mix the hypertonic saline solution your provider is asking you to use for your patchulous disorder. You can get the saline rinse bottles from any drugstore. It'll typically look like this. It'll come with a bottle with two salt packets in it. We're going to ask you to fill the bottle halfway, right about there, with distilled water only. You can also boil water, let it cool, and use that, and that'll distill the water as well. Instead of using the packets that come with the box, you can make your own packets with salt and baking soda. We're gonna ask you to unscrew the top, then fill the bottle halfway with distilled water. Just about there is fine. Then take the two salt packets that come with the box and pour it in. The cap, screw the top back on, and gently give it a shake. Then unscrew the cap, and either with a syringe or an eyedropper, take out about a syringe full. This is a 5 ml syringe or an eyedropper a solution. Put the cap back on the bottle, and you can store this either room temperature or in the refrigerator so you're not wasting the product. Then what we're gonna ask you to do is take the syringe, and when you're laying down, drop the solution inside your nose on the side that you have your patulus. So if you have your patulus on your left ear, you're gonna put the solution inside your left nose and push it down so that it lingers in the back of the ear. I'll demonstrate. I'd recommend taking a towel, putting it over um, underneath your neck, and then when you're laying down, have the towel go under your neck so that your head is at a 45 degree angle, kind of like this. If your patulus is on the left ear, you're gonna take your syringe and gently push the water in through your nose and let it linger into the back of the ear, back of the nose. And you're gonna hold your head like that for a few minutes. Usually around two to three minutes is enough. If the patulus is on the right ear, you're gonna do the same thing on the right side. And you're gonna hold your head on the right side at a 45 degree angle, like. Sometimes patients tell me that when they are pushing the product into their nose, they swallow it or it comes out from the other side. That's all normal. All we ask is you to gently press the solution into your nose so that it doesn't irritate your ear. It's okay to swallow it. It's okay for it to rinse and come out of the other side of the nose. It's okay for it to come on out from the same side of the nose. It's all totally normal. You don't have to use the entire component of the bottle, just one or two syringes on each side, depending on what your provider asked you to do. You can save the solution in the bottle for about a week, and then I toss it away and make a new fresh one, just so that it doesn't stay stale. If you have any questions, please let us know. Thank you.